Yo, what's good guys? Coach Tech here. So today we got another Bluetooth speaker to review. Now this is from Anchor. This is a Soundcore Rave. Let's get to it. All right, you guys, so this is a big box. Now that's beat up. You know, Amazon out of here playing games with UPS. Yeah, I beat up these boxes, but anyways. Oh, this thing is massive. All right, this thing is absolutely massive. We got 160 watts. Whew, you compare both of them. This thing is base up, same thing. Basically very similar to the Soundcore Trace. All right, now this, you can cop this on Amazon for $200. It's not that expensive. I'll be shocked. It's, I thought it was more like $300, $200. Of course, you got the Soundcore app. Got all that good stuff. Now, this is not waterproof. This is IPX5 uh, certified. This, so this is water submergible. So, uh, not water submergible, like, you know, water resistant. So you can splash water and whatnot. So don't go and, you know, throw this in the water. Uh, the box is dope. You know, we got typical. Got a bunch of, bunch of people out here just chilling. You know, typical white people stuff what they do we got more of them here too you know <laughs> you know what i'm saying <laughs> but anyways man let me let me pop this big thing open now all right you guys so everything is out the box just quickly we get a power cable over here we got this uh non-polarized i want to say two circles over here power over here we got a booklet over here sunshine guide anyways the speaker man this thing is absolutely massive yo for 200 dollars. jeez man i hope it sounds as good as this you know, size. Look at this. Jeez. Am I beating this thing up already? Wow. Man, this this definitely uh take this to the beach or just by the patio, man. This thing got some weight to it. It's beasting. Uh, how do you turn this bad boy on? Let's turn it on. Whoa. This thing got bass to it. Alright, anyways, it could be set like this. So you got the sound core logo up top. We got you could also put it up top too. You got, it doesn't have a handle, man. I wish this thing had a handle or some stuff. I actually got handles here in the back. You got a handle over here in the back. You have all the uh, the knobs over here, which I'm gonna go through a little bit later. We got a handle over here. Let's turn it on the back. Oof, much easier. So we got a carrying handle over here. We have a pouch over here. Oh, wow, okay, so this is official, man. So you got RCA cables over here. You could put a mic, so you can make this like a karaoke, which, you know, it is what it is. We got a USB, this is a power bank. This is where you put the power, uh, the power cord. This is where the bass is gonna come out uh, for the boom. And that's basically it. We have a USB drive over here for the, the anchor stuff. I gotta check what that is. But yeah, listen, 160 watts, man. This thing is straight beast. Let me, uh, let me power this thing up. Let me play with it. Let me see what this, uh, this thing is all about, but I'm feeling this, man. This is legit, y'all. This is absolutely beast. But anyways, let's get to it. Let's go. All right, yo, guys. So the Soundcore Rape speaker is turned up. I got to say, it's, it's pretty dope. As you can see, all these cool lighting effects and whatnot. It's a big, big speaker, as you guys can see. This will be perfect. If, listen, if you got a porch, you know what I'm saying? If you're out there living in the countryside, out there living in Texas or Florida, you know what I'm saying? You got that big property, this bad boy out there in the porch. You can put it by, if you live in New York City, you could also put this on the porch, it'll be straight. But uh, but let's run through the lighting effects first. So you have this party effect, which is pretty dope. You have this rainbow effect. I mean, I like the fact that it's such a big frame and the, the LEDs themselves are like, you know, throughout the entire speaker. You have this, I believe, breathing effect. You know, you have this other effect. I think it's a flash effect. You have this effect, color shift, and you have this effect. I think this is party. And then this basically is turned off. So you could also turn off the LEDs. Never mind. I think this is party. Yeah, this is party mode. Which of course, you could switch tracks, and of course, you could turn up the volume with the knob over here. Just slide it. You know, and the volume turns up, and you could lower the volume. But I gotta admit, rocking with the speaker, I am pretty stacked for two hundred dollars. It's not bad, but it is a big, big speaker. You know, if you want to carry to this to the beach and like put it by the beach and whatnot, you know, this would be perfect. But remember, this is not waterproof, so be careful, don't throw it in the water. But anyways, we're gonna get into the sound testing right now. But I gotta say, guys, for two hundred dollars, it ain't bad. If you can catch it on sale for a buck fifty, yeah, that's a hundred percent grab. And of course, it has a karaoke thing you could put here. But you know, it is what it is on that sense. But right now, what would I want to do is I want to just put on a switch the mic and let's uh let's put the uh, the music on and of course i am going to be doing uh comparisons with other speakers as well we're going to do a versus too 
But I gotta say, I am feeling this, y'all. I cannot hate, I am feeling this, uh, the Brave Speaker. Let's go. All right, you guys, so we're gonna turn it up right now. We're gonna hit it up at uh, like around 50% volume and then we're gonna increase it yet gradually. I do have the, uh, the, um, the uh, equalizer turned up to, um, turned on to outdoor mode and I do have the bass turned on too. So basically, you know, the, the it's Super Saiyan mode, AKA ludicrous mode, whatever you wanna call it, it is turned up. Let's hit that music and let's go, yeah. Alright, you guys, as always, I'm gonna be a buck with you. Listen, if you wanna spend 200 on it, I'll say most definitely go for it, man. It is a beast, it's a lot of fun. There's plenty of like DJ effects in there. Like I said, you could ca karaoke stuff. To each they own, for me personally, I don't care for none of that. This thing will be dope if, like I said, if you have like a porch or an outdoor, a nice backyard, you could basically put this and the battery is like insane. You can know, you could just have a rocking, bumping, you know, getting your neighbors, annoying them. You know, it's just, it's really, really fun, but I expect the loudness to be a little more louder, but it's not, unfortunately. You guys heard of max volume. I am gonna do the sound comparison with other speakers, and I'm gonna show you guys that I expect this thing for the size of it to be much more louder, to make my entire place just shake, you know, get neighbors knocking on my ceiling going absolutely insane, but it's not bad. It's not bad, $20 is good. But I want to say like maybe like 150 is the sweet spot. If you catch it for 150, definitely grab it. You know, it is, it's big. So you got to carry it and whatnot. You know, it has all that. But yo, at the end of the day, it's not a bad speaker. It's a lot of fun, yo. As always, guys, I'm Kosher Tech. I'm going to catch you guys next time, yo. Deuces, man. Let's go.